During the final year, uh, Angus had the blue nose. Um, actually, two years. Uh, he had half. He owned half stake in it. The rest of it was owned by investors and things like that. And they wanted to get rid of it. They wanted to sell her. Angus wanted to keep her as a floating museum in Lunenburg. And he said, if every man, woman, and child in Canada puts five or ten cents in, in a bank account, we can save her and we can keep her as this floating museum. And after two years with Angus's money in there, he put up half. Not one extra cent had been deposited in the account. Her masts were cut off. They installed engines. And they sailed her down and used her as a barge in the Caribbean where she met her demise 25 years after she was launched. The year I wrote this was the 75th anniversary of the launching of the Blue Nose, the 50th anniversary of her demise, and the skipper at that time of the Blue Nose II was Angus Walter's grandson, Wayne. It was so nice to see it back in the family. The captain and the Queen. One January evening, she met her fate so far away from home. Short of mass, she hauled freight for a living, then struck a reef upon some foreign shore. He heard the news and stood still for a moment. His eyes pulled up with tears he couldn't hide. You could hear it in his voice as he tried speaking. They say that night a part of him had died. He could hear the wind howling through her rigging. A blue nose and her captain coming free. He could feel the pride and grace for glory they would praise. To be the best, the captain of the queen. They christened her the Blue Nose one March morning. She turned her head toward the open sea. A thousand voices cried for victory, for pride. They cheered them on, the captain and the queen. Now a season on the Grand Bank set her metal. Judgment Day was swiftly drawing near. Scout hearts are beating fast, so finish line race past. They beat the best, the captain of the queen. You can hear the wind pounding through her rigging. The blue nose and the captain are being free. You can be the pride and grace, for glory they will praise. You can be the best, the captain of the queen. Hard for 18 seasons on the Grand Banks. From Gloucester's challenge, never did they stray. But the days of sail had passed. He stayed with her till the last. Then he cast her lines and watched her steam away. Now the captain has a grandson who's a captain. The Blues has a daughter who's a queen. Together once again, riding high against the wind. Captain of the Queen, you can feel their pride and grace, for glory.